still don't know what middle school I'm going to. Which schools did you apply to? I applied for my first choice, Orange Grove. A teacher is an educator first, a supporter, a parent. A description teacher Joe Ritaski proudly fulfills. Definitely with our students, it's not going to be a 7.30 to 2.15 job with them. You're going to come in early and give them support. You're going to stay after school and help them out. Joe oversees math resources at Foster Elementary in Tampa, a school filled with working class parents who can't always take off for extracurricular activities. Here we are their parents. You're going to be driving them to special events. He's a teacher passionate about digits, oh, yeah, and his nice students jump are number Take one. one and jump here and jump there. Mr. Chesky is a really supporting teacher. He helps me out with like my math, and he gives me a lot of motivation. I just really like that about him. He's like another father to me. Fidella, she is a fifth grader here. She is one who's been at foster since uh, kindergarten through fifth grade and that's kind of rare for our school because we have a lot of kids moving here and there. To engage students in math, Joe makes learning a game, literally. Ha. He uses Tivitz, a math and strategy game geared to kids ages 8 to 14. It can be played as a board game or online. Tivitz is as easy to learn as checkers, but it's as challenging as chess to master because there are a lot of strategies and advanced strategies that you can employ uh, to manipulate and irritate your opponent. Steve Scully is the creator of Tivitz. He and CEO Siobhan Mullen are on a mission to inspire students to learn the language of math. If kids could just speak that language, especially in the information age, they would be much more comfortable and much more successful, and we as a country would be much more competitive. But to make students listen, you have to speak their language. You can't teach a child anything until you do one thing first, and that is you have to get their attention. Games, hands-on activities will get a, a child's attention. And if it's fun and engaging, uh, then you have their attention, and, and now you can teach them something. Tivitz is endorsed by thousands of teachers nationwide who use it in the classroom. In Tampa alone, more than 50,000 students have participated in the Tivitz program, and the numbers are growing. The teachers just love it. It fits right in with our curriculum as far as fluency and, and thinking skills, strategies. As computation becomes easier through play, students perform better. Double jump, son! My grades have gone from a B to an A, which is really good because now I'm at the goal I really wanted to reach. This learning tool led to after-school clubs and exciting Tibbetts tournaments around the country. But a place was needed for kids to practice and play. A little snack, a little brain food, take a nugget, a napkin, and a sauce. Enter the venue kids love. This is a golden opportunity for us to help endorse mathematics and for McDonald's to be a part of it by opening up our lobbies and let our kids engage here. Casper's company, owner of more than 50 McDonald's in Tampa Bay, became a partner and invited other franchisees to join in too. All we really had to do was offer some seats in our restaurants for them to play. So let me see this, it doesn't cost us anything. It's during the slowest time of the day and we're bringing in parents and students and teachers. It was a no-brainer. And like that, Tibbetts Tuesdays was born. By being here at McDonald's, we're able to let the students come, experience that strategy against students from other schools. So we're really excited that we have the opportunity for students to participate. From February through May, Tampa's 55 McDonald's hosts Tibbetts Tuesdays during after-school hours. It's very fun because we get to uh, play and also eat while we're there, McDonald's. <laughs> but McDonald's support is about more than selling Happy Meals. What impressed me was the engagement of the kids with the game, the parents with their kids, and the teacher involvement. It was a trifecta of educational joy. Students 
can earn points to qualify for tournaments where they compete for trophies and scholarships. For fun, the events are held at Major League Ballparks. It's all part of the nationwide Ripken Baseball Tibbets program. We're encouraging all kids, all schools across the country to participate in this challenge. More than 20,000 finalists have participated in Tibbets Challenge tournaments around the country. The response, overwhelming. They love to play, they love the competition, and I like that they think they're just playing a game, but they're really learning. For first place, fourth grade from Esrig is Abigail Dietrich. And the bragging rights are pretty sweet. You each have two left. That's gonna be a race. But without Tibbetts Tuesdays, tournament competition would suffer. It's like having the Super Bowl or the World Series without ever having a season. So no opportunity is missed. Joe Rataski provides transportation for students who need a ride. My father works, so he can't take me and my mom doesn't drive. So we have him take me, which is really nice of him. And it paid off. Fidella was one of the top students to qualify for the city championship at Steinbrenner Field. The Tibbetts tournament meant a lot to me. Even though we didn't win, it was actually very fun. What is leaving our restaurants and going out into the community is huge for us. Now, do we sell an extra burger or fry or a McNugget or shake in the process? Maybe. But in the broader sense, the community relations value of this, you can't put a price on it. Hopefully when my students leave and move on, if they just remember that I was there for them and trying to give them the best education and the best support possible. For one student, it's already happened. Mr. Tusky is a nice teacher and I always remember him in my heart because he was one of the best supporting teachers ever. In life, there will always be figures that are greater than we realize.